While you're on hudking.com, click on the bird to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or put a zip code or street name in the search bar to see other real virtual tours. We are here at 1503 Chinook. That's 1503 Chinook. This home is located in the West Cove Village subdivision. Relatively new neighborhood. And this is a really cute three bedroom, two and a half bath home. Built in 2011, it's approximately 1,662 square feet. It sits on a 6,068 square foot lot, approximately. And the exterior has a little bit of brook, brick, rather, has a little bit of hardy plank siding, some wood trim. Some nice, cute landscaping here. All in all, exterior wise, being built in 2011, it's in good shape. Let's take a look at the backyard and then we'll take a look at the inside. So as we step out of the backyard, you do notice it has a nice covered deck here. And this home is at a at the corner, so it has sort of a pie-shaped lot. Decent size square footage of, of this lot. I thought, I thought the lot was going to be smaller. But there's a view back off the home. And you can see they did construct a wooden deck, a wooden patio. You can have access to it off of the top there. But you have room for a pool back here. Exterior-wise, it's in great condition. Let us look at the inside. Well, as we walk in, one of the things about this size home, guys, I've mentioned it before, it's approximately 1,662 square feet, so there's going to be one living area and one dining area. Now, when you walk in, you do have a combined living and dining room here. The carpet is in bad shape, no doubt about it. You're going to want to replace the carpet. But what you have here when you walk into the left is your dining room here. You can fit a nice little table there. And then you have your family or your living room here. Now there is some sheetrock damage. It looks like they had one of those wall mounted TVs. So you want to either put your TV over that or patch it. Patching it is very easy. Fixing sheetrock is, is, no, is very easy to do. There's some holes over here. And we walk around and we have your big open kitchen. It has pretty granite countertops, which is nice. I was not expecting that in this home. And it actually has room for a small breakfast table. So you, do, you could put a small breakfast table here and then use that uh, living area as all your living space, but it has nice countertops, beautiful backsplash. The appliances are here with the exception of the refrigerator. It has nice high ceilings. We have your indoor pantry right here. Around this corner here, we're gonna have a half bathroom, so your guests don't have to go upstairs to use the facilities. You can just stay right here. And then you have an indoor utility room. Your washer and dryer connections are here, as well as access to your garage. Now it is dark in there guys, so you won't be able to see much, but trust me, it's just a two car garage. And then the door leading in here is damaged. So downstairs, fresh coat of paint, a tiny bit of sheetrock repair, replace that door, replace the carpet, then you're done. Very, very minimal expense on the downstairs. Now upstairs is where you're gonna have the other three bedrooms, so we'll take a look up there. And as we go up the staircase, you'll see the carpet is also dirty here, and there's evidence of some sheetrock damage here. So you'll wanna replace the carpeting, definitely, and the sheetrock. When we get upstairs, we're gonna to go to the left. And if we come around to the left, we have bedroom number one at the rear of the home. Bedroom number one, the paint is in fair condition, but the carpet is dirty. So you're gonna to wanna to replace this carpet. This bedroom is about a 10 by 10, so it's not a huge bedroom, but you know, for a kid's, kid's room, this is not, not a bad size. It's adequate. Come around here, we have bedroom number two. Bedroom number two is a tiny bit bigger. But once again, you're going to want to paint this room and you're going to want to put in some carpet. The sliding doors for the closet there. Continue around. We have bathroom number one. Full bathroom number one has linoleum tile. It's a shower and tub combo with a single vanity. Cute little window there giving you some natural lighting. And it's in good, good condition. We come around here and you actually have an upstairs living room, which is neat. I was not expecting that on this home, but you have an upstairs living slash family room. Let me come around to this corner here and show you. Now it looks like they did have the wall wired with speakers. So you want to repair that, patch that, very easy to do. But that's neat, at least you have a second living area upstairs. And then we come to the master bedroom. Now the master bedroom is missing a door. This door frame is a little bit cracked. It's going to need some uh, wall repair, some sheetrock repair. Looks like some kids got in and vandalized it. But all in all, not a bad room. We come over, we have your master bath. Now your master bathroom is gonna have a big single vanity and a garden tub and shower combo. So it's a big garden tub, nice shower. The door is damaged. You have two windows and you have, and I'm looking at this right, yeah, it looks like some kids got in and, and knocked out one of the panes from this 
So you want to repair that window. And then you have access to that outdoor patio. Now there are some wood slats that are coming up, so they've asked us not to go out there. And then you have your master closet. So all in all, not a bad home. It is going to need a little bit of repair, but you know, nothing huge. Mostly minor cosmetic stuff. Let me give you a formal summary. Well, there it is, guys. 1503 Chinook. That's 1503 Chinook. Very charming. Three bedroom, two and a half bath home. Needs a little bit of cosmetic work, but all in all, not bad. This could be a beautiful home for you and your family. So, guys, if you're interested in this home, it is listed right now for only 129 If you don't have a realtor and you'd like more information, I'd love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan. I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.